Hello, my name is David Rydell. I'm a senior process engineer with Arcadis, specifically focused on uh, industrial water and wastewater treatment in the environment. So what are the key takeaways about pharmaceuticals in the environment? We've been detecting them for near on 20 years due to improved analytical methods. There's been multiple studies demonstrating that there is, is an impact, and a negative impact to the aquatic environment, uh, especially downstream of municipal wastewater treatment plants. Uh, there's been in reports of fish that are intersex. Uh, they have, have female uh, reproductive organs when they're males. Uh, but there's also been research demonstrating that by improving wastewater treatment technologies, we can reduce the incidence of that. So that's one takeaway of pharmaceuticals in the environment. Next one is we as humans are really the, the key contributor to the environment we, through our consumption, our, our use of pharmaceuticals. There are other sources, including production, hospitals, uh, agricultural activities, and then just disposal of it. And then the final takeaway is what can we do about it? As I mentioned, improving wastewater treatment is one of the, the, the best ways, but also just looking at how we are, are consuming pharmaceuticals, what they're being prescribed for, making sure that we are prescribing the right drug for the, the application and in the right dose and, and course. So human consumption is the largest contributor to the environment at greater than 85% of what's detected in the environment. The catch is that it's often in a, a larger flow and a, a much lower concentration at the point where we can feasibly treat it, which is at the, the municipal wastewater treatment plant. So really we have to look at what we're doing upstream. How are we consuming that, that, that prescription? Is it the right prescription for what we have? Uh, and how are we disposing of our, our unused pharmaceuticals? The previous guidance was you dump it down the, the drain. It's since changed and we look more at incinerating it, disposing of it in landfills. Uh, and ultimately it's, it's being a responsible user of the, the pharmaceuticals and, and, and understanding how, how it in, in, can impact downstream organisms, receiving waters, and our drinking water ultimately.